Alrighty guys, it's showtime once again on the Riggland YouTube channel for the Underscore 5 Skyrim. The last video we traveled from Whiterun to Riften to Ivorkstead up to the 7,000 steps and up to Hyrule Rothgar. And then once we got to Hyrule Rothgar, we met the Greybeards. We learned a couple new shouts, a new word. And then once we returned down from Hyrule Rothgar to back to Ivorkstead, we were attacked by some cultists who were sent by Marak in Solstheim. And these and Marek is another dragonborn in another country. And we're going to be going to go fight him here soon. But as of right now, we have been sent by the Great Bears to go find the Horn of Yargan Windcaller. What? What? Those bandits just fell over dead. Anyhow, lucky for me. The Greybeards had sent us to find the, the horn of Jorgen Windcaller. And Jorgen Windcaller was the founder of the Greybeards. And he was a leader in the Nord army that suffered a great defeat. And Jorgen Windcaller went on to find and create the Way of the Voice. And if you don't know what the Way of the Voice is, then... The Way of the Voice is... Basically kind of like a code for people that know how to shout and the code pretty much just says that the shouting ability that one can have was a gift from the gods so they're going to use that ability to please and worship the gods however since we are dragonborn we probably aren't going to be following that route completely Get it, Lydia. Yeah. It's beautiful whenever the door blocker does something good, you know? From what I remember, this isn't a long quest. Zarya was actually a pretty good fighter, from what I remember. <laughs> pretty sure that's how we get out of here. Once you go all the way around, you come, there's a little like a, a lever or something like that you pull, and this wall will come down. Okay. <laughs> yes, Lydia, I might be a little lost. For those of you wondering, I am. Oh, okay, I can level up. I'm gonna save that, actually. Ah, oh, I can't. Ah, uh, put it towards stamina. Should probably focus on my one hand a little more. Kind of ne neglecting that lately. Yeah, but those of you wondering what I'm having. Why this combat is taking me a little while to be killing the enemies because I am a level 11. We're gonna adapt to the difficulty. Fish robe 
just sounds so weird after doing the boost for a dog for so long. I know there's a word wall around here somewhere. Pretty sure it's, yeah, it's right there. Is it, is it? No, it's right there. And there's some plates that trigger plates.
not sure much much of anything over here. some action too, you know. Room 
at the sleeping giant inn in Riverwood, and I'll meet you, a friend. Wonderful. Somebody had took the horn before we got here without killing any of the enemies except for one dragger over there, apparently. And who we have? I guess I'm gonna be cheap and grab all the little coins on the ground. We got some gold, a ruby, skull, blizzard, and some armor, and staff. Not bad. Alright, once we're gonna get out of here, we're gonna go ahead and fast travel up to Riverwood, or down to Riverwood. Well, if you're wondering how I got here, I didn't include that in this video, but I had fast travel back to the White Run Stables. I took a carriage over to Morthal, and I, head, I headed northeastern of Morthal up until Uston Grav, or Euston Grav, or where that place is called. That's where we're at now. And that's where the Greybeard sent me to find that horn. But somebody has taken or taken that horn that we we're supposed to get. And now we've got to go to Riverwood, sit with John in, and rent to the attic room. Yeah, it was here a minute ago. The best that sets the game up like that to make you go all the way around in a big circle, go through a puzzle or two. Joe just took in a little door and spent it two, three minutes. Then I guess the game wouldn't be as in depth as what it is. Even though, like, I really like this game, and to me it's one of the most beautiful games ever made. And it's my personally my second favorite game of all time. Behind guess what guess what it is? Only Oblivion. And I say God of War 4 is third and Last of Us is fourth. But it's a very beautiful game, and I like it a lot, but it does have its problems. Like one thing is, once you go up to Hyrule Rothgar, Great Bears just give you those shouts basically for nothing. And the game gives you a lot of stuff whenever you don't really deserve it, or they give you stuff prematurely. What's up, then, dog? Wait, aren't you dead? No. Anyway, what's up, dog? And another thing is, large part of the game is go and find, go retrieve, go retrieve, go get this, go here and grab that, like, here's retrieve, here's retrieve, retrieve, and that's, that's three out of, two out of one, two, three, four, five, six quests have been retrieved, and we have another one about to enter that. And if you play the Companions quest line, it has a lot to do with retrieve and retrieve and retrieve. It's still a beautiful game though. I've played this game since it came out in 2011, and I've played it on Xbox 360 when it came out for a few years, up until like 2014, 15-ish. And I quit playing video games altogether up until about 2017. And I bought a PS3. And I played Skyrim on that again. And I've been playing games ever since then. That was 2020. And I've been playing play Skyrim so well. on PS4 With now. You is my I feel. You're that visitor been poking around. Oh, Sven. Yes. Do I'd like to rent the attic room. Wink, wink. Is he actually going to charge me 10 attic gold? Room, really? Well. We don't have an attic room, but you can have the one on the left. Make right, yourself right, at home. Right. So you steal from me, or you steal what I'm about to go retrieve, and then you I'm the charge innkeeper. me to get it back? It's my business to keep track of strangers. Doesn't really make much sense. But whatever. Um, I don't like how I'm being subdued into a room. So you're the Dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. Yeah. I think you're looking for this. Yeah, I am. I, I was. Can you get my tank going back? Alright, I'll kill everyone down there. Give me a mug of ale. Coming right up. Hey, now I can take stuff. I need some more ale, or no. I should. You've had food. more than enough. Besides, you still haven't paid for the last one. I'll find some more for you. I always. 
there be dragons. Until then, I've no way for you. Alright. That's a beauty of becoming What are you doing that for? Nah, no, what do you want? Close the door. You just find that lying around? Yeah. Must be your lucky day. Yeah, it is. Uh, now close the door, there's two other people in here, but now we can talk. And another door's right open, but now we can talk. Here's that, there's a second copy of the Book of the Dragonborn. In my first video, I was talking about there's only two copies of the Book of the Dragonborn. Yeah, right here. The Book of the Dragonborn. There's one in the keep at Helgen at the very beginning when Alda one attacks. And there's another copy somewhere in the main quest line, which is right here. I'm definitely going to take that. I usually keep those ever since I found that out from a friend. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. Well, I am, so... You want to take the horn? Surprise. I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. What's with the cloak and dagger? You can't be too careful. I'll see a cloak Thou and more dagger. spies are everywhere. What do you want with I me? didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Alright, go on. Like I I'm said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. How about I don't kill you now? Why did you take the horn from Ustingrave? I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were Dragonborn. Yes. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeard sent, and not some Thalmor plant. Okay. Why are you looking for a Dragonborn? We remember what most don't. That the Dragonborn is the ultimate Dragon Slayer. Yep. Yeah. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can yep. you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Yeah. Done it a couple times. Good. And you'll have a chance to prove it to so Let's play through. We remember what most... You are the only one that can kill a dragon permanently. To the dumb yes. after you? We're very old enemies. And if my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. Right, right. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be dragonborn. Yeah, I am. It's kind of what the whole game's built around. But yeah, some more for you. The, sometime the blades I started, or the Thalmor started hunting down the blades, and the blades went into hiding, and they have become a former shell. They have become a shell of its former self. And the blades are, were originally meant as bodyguards for the emperor, kind of like how the Secret Service is for the president in the U.S. They were the blades, and then once they had failed, and oblivion. They, uh, they are attacked by the Mythic Dawn. They assassinate the Emperor of, of Cyrodiil. He's in Cyrodiil at this time. They assassinate the Emperor. And the Blades, the Blades, like they felt, they failed. And over time, they went to being Dragon Hunters. And then for some reason, I can't remember the Republic to find out, the Blade, the Thalmor started hunting down the Blades and killing them off. And I they went into hiding. But I guess even my paranoia has its limits. Yeah, you like I'm an part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you for a very long time. If you really are a dragon, I'll how paranoid they are with the Before government. I tell you any more, all these conspiracies. I need to make sure I can trust you. Yeah, 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 yeah. We get that. Okay. Dragons aren't just coming back; they're coming back to life. They hmm. weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. Okay. You know how crazy this sounds, woman? <laughs> a few years sounds ago, ridiculous. I said almost the same thing to a colleague of mine. 
Well, it turned out he was right and I was wrong. Alright. What makes you think dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty. And I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Alright. How'd you figure all this out? You should know. You got the map for me from Bleak Falls Barrow. The Dragonstone was a uh. map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. It seems to be spreading from the southeast, down in the Gerald's near Rifton. The one at Kynes Grove is next, if the pattern holds. All right, all right. So, I don't remember exactly how you set up that chain of event, but when you do the Bleak Falls Barrow quest, Delphine will come to Farngar, and she'll talk to him, and she'll be wearing a leather armor, kind of like what I'm wearing, but she'll be wearing like a full suit of it with the the, the hood and all, and Farngar will be talking to her about dragons and stuff for a quick second, and then she'll be acting all shady and stuff. But we missed that out, I'm pretty sure. We missed out on that. But that's normally what happens, and that's what kind of what she was talking about. And I'm assuming Farngar sent me to go get the Dragonstone for her. Kynes Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. And the dragon stone is basically a map of dragon burial sites. I'm not going to spoil anything, but we're going to find out how that comes into play here soon. I need to Let's get into my dragon. traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. Alright, you have fun. Here's a map we take. I don't care. And over here. That's better. Yeah. Let's get on the... She just changes right in front of me. She just trusts me. Alright, there's some loot over here. Some potions we can grab. Some ingredients. Alright, and once we get out of the Super and Giant Inn, this could be it for this video. And we, we got go rooms and food. Return to Drink the Great Beards. And I then we'll go kill this dragon in now. the next video. Kind of this way. Right we can now. travel together or split up and meet there. Yes. Your choice. Okay. As of right now, I'll see you in the next video, and this is Rick on signing off.